Hey, I hope you're having an amazing day today. In today's video, I'm gonna be answering the question, why do dogs lick you? So let's get straight into the video. Some dogs like to lick people more than others. Is this a behavioral thing? Does this behavior mean something? Why do dogs lick the way that they do? Is it ever a problem? Well, the answers depend on you and your dog. While we don't know exactly why dogs lick, most experts can agree that there are a various number of reasons on why they do. Licking is not considered a serious behavioral problem unless it affects you. Knowing the reason why your dog may lick may even change the way you feel about it. Starting off with number one, I think the main reason why dogs lick is because of affection. They want to show you that they love you, that they care about you, and that is one way to communicate that. Dogs show affection by licking people, and on top of that, they might even lick other dogs to show that too. Licking is a natural action for dogs. They learned it from grooming and affection from their mothers when they were puppies, as of course the mother would groom and lick her puppies right when they were born. Some dogs tend to lick less than others, but that doesn't mean your dog doesn't love you any less. That's just who they are as an individual dog. He or she might have just learned things differently as they tend to grow up or when they were a puppy. Uh, but again, that doesn't mean that he or she doesn't love you any less than any other dog. Another reason why dogs tend to lick is because of attention. They want your attention, they want you to play with them, and so licking is a good way of doing that. I have a friend, Jacob, who has a dog named Cloud, and he would tell me every single morning when Cloud needs to go back bathroom outside to let him out into the backyard cloud would just start licking jacob's hands my friend's hands it's weird but hey it does get jacob up in the morning <laughs> licking behavior that starts out as affection can be reinforced by a person's reactions whether they're laughing smiling or if they get up to let you out in the backyard as a result of licking attention can be a result of that Maybe your dog is bored, maybe your dog is lonely, maybe your dog just wants to play, or in Jacob's case, uh, maybe his dog wants to go outside and go bathroom, whatever it may be, even negative attention is attention and any type of reaction towards licking will reinforce that behavior. The third reason why dogs may lick is maybe because of instinct. I don't know how true this is, but again, this is just according to some experts, but when wolves would return back to their puppies, they would actually re regurgitate their meals to their young ones and their young ones uh, would actually lick their parents mouth for their food. It is believed that this action, this behavior has been passed down through DNA and can partially be the answer to why dogs like to lick faces. The fourth reason simply may be because you just taste good. As weird as this sounds, once a dog starts licking you, they might be intrigued to why you more often than not taste a bit salty. Dogs love anything that have an interesting taste and at least in my experience, Jackson, every time he finds something, whether it just smells weird or tastes differently outside when we go on walks, he just can't help himself with like, like tasting it, licking it, or putting it in his mouth. And on top of that, licking is a way for them to explore the world. And at the end of the day, as cheesy as this sounds, you are their world. And the last reason why experts may think dogs lick is due to obsessive compulsive behavior. Although it can be rare, dogs can suffer from this disorder. This disorder can be a result of prolonged stress and anxiety, so you want to make sure that you give your dog the most relaxed lifestyle, a healthy lifestyle, and a loving lifestyle. Licking that occurs nonstop and frequently can be a problem, so just make sure to monitor your dog and how, or she, how he or she is licking. If you think it is a problem, make sure to talk to your vet and set up an appointment with them to make sure that you can ease it if it is the case, and if not, look at ways to really prevent that from actually happening. In the age old question, is it safe for dogs to lick you? Is it dangerous? Is it healthy? Yes, it is a relatively harmless for dogs to lick you despite them licking toilets and a lot of things. Their mouths can contain some bacteria, but to us humans, it won't influence us greatly to the point where it is actually dangerous to us. So let your dogs kiss you if you want. For me, Jackson, I'm actually uh, mildly allergic to dogs. And one of those factors that can really trigger my allergies is saliva. So with Jackson growing up, I kind of made it a habit that he won't lick my face or do anything like that. I do let him lick my arms, my hands, but never the face. And he's trained not to do so. So 
Again, if that's the case, then go ahead and do that route. But at the end of the day, this is a way for your dogs to show affection to you, to show them that, to show you that they love you so much and to thank you for everything that you were doing in their lives. All right, guys, that concludes today's video. Let me know down below in the comment section if your dog is licky, if you let them, why or why not. I would love to read them in the comment section down below. As a reminder, please hit that like button as it really helps in the YouTube algorithm. And if you're new here, welcome. Please hit that subscribe button too as it really means a lot to Jackson and me. Also, don't forget, I created an Aussie Doodle Lovers slash Owners Facebook group. The link is in the description. You do not have to own an Aussie Doodle at all to join. Click the link in the description, join. We love to grow the community there. Tell your dogs you love them. Jackson, I love you. Thank you for watching and have an amazing day. Yay!